Hey YouTube. Um, all right, well, I'm going to post, uh, uh, it's the first video uh, review actually uh, that I've done up until now. It's been all uh, just updates on my vehicles and, and whatnot. And I'm going to do a review of the Shelby GT350 that I had taken an earlier video of uh, showing the Whipple su uh, supercharger being installed. Um, actually, it was already sort of installed and they were just finishing it up. Uh, and then it took a little while for me to get uh, in touch with the owner to um, set up a, a time to where we could actually take a look at it and go for a ride. Uh, so this is a, a review primarily of the supercharger, not of the car uh, itself. Uh, there's you know, a ton of reviews on Shelby GT350s, but I just want to go for a ride and hopefully give you guys an idea as to you know what the car is now um, after the supercharger install so you're going to watch the video and the camera is kind of all over the place i'm just recording with an iphone and i mean every time he hits the gas i just, I just lose control uh, of the camera but hopefully you get an idea um, it's really to showcase um, the supercharger itself uh, the uh, acceleration the throttle response uh, just I, you know I hope you get the feeling of how powerful this car now is 810 wheel horsepower claims uh, through the uh, through Whipple uh, to the rear wheels uh, so that's like 920 horsepower crank whatever uh, so a ridiculous number uh, and you know seat of the pants it, it, it really did feel powerful I, I mean just an incredible ride so I hope you enjoy the video all right all right YouTube so here it is took me a little while uh, but I finally met up with the owner uh, Tommy uh, he brought the car up to Ernie's and this is the finished product so video without any light let me get her on the other side here maybe that'll work there it is, the Whipple. Um, they did the reservoir tank as well. They did a Mishimoto because, quite honestly, it looks like shit when you when you put all that in there and then you leave the uh, plastic factory tank in there. So that's it. We're gonna go for a ride now, and then we'll talk with Tommy, and he'll give you his impressions on it from a driving standpoint. Right now, we're gonna take a ride with Ernie. He owns the shop. So, he'll give us some technical info on it. And then if you have any questions, Ernie's Transmissions and Mount Cop PA. All right. All right, we're starting out in the 2016 Shelby GT350 with Whipple Supercharger. It was uh, installed at Ernie's Transmissions and there's that transmission at Crystal's. That sounds awesome. Ernie, how long would you say it took you to put this in? About a 12 hour install. The uh, the kit was uh, fairly comprehensive, right? I mean, I know you had your your issues early. Uh, a couple little that. issues we ran into, a plug problem, we were able to straighten out, get a new pigtail sent to us overnight. But other than that, it, very well put together kit. They give you all the factory covers, make everything look factory original all over again when you put it all together. It's a very nice package. Yeah, I did notice that it does look like it came on the car. And, you know, we're driving down the road now. Um, fairly average speed. We're at 2,000 RPM. And uh, the car really does feel what I would consider to be stock right now. They do say that on startup, um, the motor has to actually uh, decompress. So these motors come, they're high compression. Um, so the tune actually um, uses opens the up. Variable timing to right, it uses, valve. Correct, it uses that variable timing and it opens the exhaust valves to decompress the motor uh, on startup so that the compression isn't real high. Typically on a forced induction vehicle, 
it's usually a lower compression um, uh, piston and, and whatever uh, just to uh, make sure it, it applies that power properly and uh, so they have managed uh, to um, do that in the tune and this was a lethal performance tuner yeah with a Whipple 29 so the tune actually comes from, from lethal performance from lethal performance and the kit was from uh, lethal performance built, as well right did right. you go through them everything was drawn but built by Whipple show you uh, the startup on this. Go ahead, Ern. guys so I'm gonna finish this up we're gonna uh, introduce the owner of the vehicle and he's just gonna give you you know some insight as to how the car has been to live with uh, this is Tommy Tommy say hello hello everyone so tell us Tom uh, what do you think so far I mean the car is awesome no matter which way you want to use it you want to use it you want to be really fast be really fast you want to cruise at nice speeds cruise at nice speeds uh, the work that Ernie's transmissions did on this is second to none in my opinion the fit and finish everything is perfect uh, it, it's it really depends on how you want to use it you can break your neck in two seconds or you can really just go out and cruise and enjoy the day and it runs great no matter which way you want to use it yeah the throttle response you said is, is, is instant, right on instant instantaneous right. and uh, so it's safe to say you're you're pretty happy with, I'm extremely with, happy with the yeah. kit so we had the kit from uh, lethal performance um, uh, so Whipple supplied the kit and sold through uh, Lethal Performance. The tune was done through Lethal Performance. That's correct. And then it was yep. all installed here all at installed Ernie's. There. Right. And the job that they did, like I said, second to none. The fit and finish on it's perfect. They just they just did a great job all around on it. Awesome. I couldn't ask for better. That's awesome. This is, I got to say, this is <laughs> by far uh, the the fastest car I've ever been in, uh, and just uh, just an amazing car. Uh, like Tommy said. You could take this thing to the track. You throw slicks and, and skinnies on this thing, and uh, you could take it to a quarter mile track, Absolutely. and and you'll you'll eat them up and uh, take it to a ro uh, road course. 
Um, just phenomenal. Just phenomenal. It is all around. Yeah. All Great. around. I'm very, very happy Great with the car. whole car. All right, Tommy. Thanks. I appreciate no, no you. No problem, Dino. I appreciate you bringing the car around. And, I appreciate and, you doing the video. Yeah, and uh, we're going to get this posted. So anybody out there with a Shelby GT350 that is in the area, um, you know, these are the guys, obviously, that you want to have do your do your car up. And, and um, they work on all kinds of Mustangs. Like I said, they're, they're going to be working on a Corvette as well. But, you know, there are not very many Shelby GT350s that... Uh, have a, uh, a Whipple supercharger on them um, at least not to my knowledge there's not that many on on YouTube um, so you know hope you guys got all the info uh, that you were looking for uh, you can still hit me up I can get in touch with Tommy at any time so if there's any questions um, that you might have for me that I don't have uh, the answers to I'll get in touch with Tommy and and he can help you out all right all right guys take care